Hello, this is Francis from McCaffrey's Crafts and today I thought I'd give you a little tour of my shop. Um, I, I need to do a few more things on here as well because uh, I'll be opening up soon enough but um, there's not really many tourists around. I think when people come in here I'll set this up as a little hand uh, sanitizer zone and I'll put some hand sanitizer there and uh, you know my shop uh, I can't leave in too many people at a time but not too many people come here anyway. Um, so here is the kind of shop and I've created like a little walkway that you walk around here, come around and, and come back out again. So I kind of do this video to kind of give a little kind of walkthrough of, of my shop. Um, I'm going to put um, some more products on this table here. I haven't quite finished uh, setting that one up yet. But anyway, I thought I'd kind of give you a kind of uh, a guide of my shop. So when someone comes in here, I have a few of the uh, ladies Guinness t-shirts and stuff there. And uh, a few of kind of uh, these kind of scarves that, that are actually quite nice. Um, right there. Uh, most of these things are available uh, for sale on my shop. So the walk will kind of bring you across this way uh, to start. Um, so here I have some nice uh, Aran uh, cushions um, that, that are actually, uh, you know, very contemporary color there. They match with quite a, quite a lot of furniture. I have my, my Aran jumpers and wools and stuff over here, uh, you know, uh, that that jumper there is 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 quite popular. Um, up here I have some old pictures of our of Calorglan, the town that I'm in, like the old railway, the old bicycle club. That's looking down, um, looking down the town, uh, sports team, a uh, little bit of let's see, a little bit of a uh, horse and cart, uh, the pipe band, and this is actually um, what the shop used to look like, um, O'Regan's. Uh, so this this shop that I oc occupy now, that's kind of what it uh, what it used to be um, in that regard. So come down this section of the shop, walk down here. You have a number of uh, ladies' t-shirts there. I have a few of the old tourist hats, a few kind of wool socks. These these wool socks are actually pretty good. Uh, they're they're hundred percent wool. Uh, you know Jacob sheep and, and and various sheep there. Just a few of the kind of Irish kind of. Uh, Bit of memorabilia. I have a bit of a bargain pole here, where I, I throw things up for a bit bit cheaper. Uh, you know, for a number of different products as well. Um, so that yeah. So we walk down the shop. We'll come to the the walking stick section there um, in a second. Um, here I have have all the uh, the the flat caps. Um, it's usually patchwork that I like in the flat caps. This is a uh, uh, hundred percent tweed. Um, I have the the with some blue with some grey. And with the hint of red and with the the, the green um the the, the it's quite quite a popular hat as well then over there i have some more t-shirts uh actually I'm, i must move that thing out of the way um there in that corner i kind of do my my packing and my shipping and different things as well um so yeah so there is my shop and um down here, I still have to kind of sort out this section here. So my, my plan for today is I'm probably going to tidy up this area because I've kind of half cleaned the shop. And uh, you can see here is kind of a bit messy that I've got to uh, have a look at and and, uh, and sort this out. So I find these, these kind of things quite handy to display sticks. You can get about 38 sticks in there. So those three are, are kind of full uh, there at the moment. Um, I have to think of a way to kind of organize things a bit better if someone someone's comes in. Um, usually I hang the, the hiking poles up here with the, the cudgels. So um, I just got to make some more of the, the hiking poles now. So usually a hiking pole, cudgel, hiking pole, cudgel. Um, and then I kind of put them on the wall uh, there. Uh, so there's the kind of uh, all the, the sticks that I kind of have online there at the moment. Number them there. Um, sometimes people want these type of wood turn sticks and stuff as well. I don't do too many of them, but people come into the shop locally asking from, so I kind of order in a few of them. Video up for a second. So yeah, so I've ordered those guys in as well. And uh, there's the kind of counter where I do things. There's my little back room where I do my printing and all my DHL packing and, and things like that. And uh, yeah, I just give you kind of another quick view of the shop. So this is kind of my, my physical shop. Um, if you come to to Calorglan, um, 
you know, you can see my car parked outside there. If you come to my shop, this is kind of what you'll see and encounter. Um, usually, uh, I kind of open a shop by appointment only because I'm a kind of a one man show. So sometimes I'm in my workshop working on blackthorn sticks. So if you want to visit the shop, um, it's best to kind of give me a call or a message just to make sure I'm open. I'm usually here in the mornings and the afternoons. I'm off like working on, on the sticks because uh, I can't uh, be in kind of two places at once. And it's, uh, you know, the shop doesn't, you know, it does okay, but not enough to, to hire like a bunch of people to, to, to work here, especially during the pandemic. So yeah, if you want to visit my shop, here's what you'll encounter. Um, and I thought, I'd give you guys a, a quick look at that today and uh, you know thank you for watching and uh, thanks for supporting the channel